self-priming centrifugal pump is mainly composed of pump shell impeller and flange, and the accessories installed on the pump shell are the most, including water retaining valve, water inlet seat, water outlet seat, and pipe connection, etc. When the water is fed to the pump, if the water flow of the tank is found to the inlet pipe, you can check whether the water retaining valve is intact, and the water cannot be self-primed during pumping. First ensure that the inlet pipe is intact, and after the connection with the pipe is tight, you can check whether the sealing ring in the pipe fitting is intact. The sealing effect of the sealing ring is not good when the water is discharged and the pipe is connected, and the leakage will affect the head and flow rate. The impeller and the vortex shell are the key components of the pump. The impeller has good permeability, can allow some small particles in the water. There is a water wind component behind the impeller, and the water wind on the flange is supporting the water wind damage will also leak, resulting in the inability to self suction water. The sealing ring on the vortex shell is used in the impeller when working to isolate the pump shell inside and pump shell inlet. If it is found that the self priming water is not filled, check the sealing ring after ensuring that the water inlet pipe and water inlet are not leaking. The main function of the flange is to install the water pump with the closed pump shell. The outer sealing ring, if the pump shell is damaged, it will not be able to store water. If the damage is not serious, it can also be observed that there will be water leakage during work.